Rash by Pete Hopman, video by Sarah Bond, Carolyn Vaness, and Hannah Trapini. It's the year 2074 and all Bo Marston wants to do is run, but in a nation obsessed with safety, making things like football illegal that's not possible to do without the proper protection, meaning helmets, knee pads, elbow pads, shin guards, hand guards, and more padding on top of that. To top it off, he is forced to run on a spongy track so he won't get hurt, so they're not moving very fast. But he still wants to reach his goal of beating the school's record owned by his arch rival, Carlos Mink. But the problem is, Carlos makes him mad. Whenever he's around him, he gets frustrated. And then he gets so mad that he blows up at him. Considering he can be sent to a work plant for five years for something as small as forgetting to wear a helmet when you take a walk, it's no wonder that his father and brother were both in jail. It says on page 13, I'm just going to do my best, I said, shrugging it off. On the outside, I was cucumber cool, but on the inside, I was starting to boil. I knew he was trying to get under my skin. Maddie Wilson was my girlfriend. Just having her and Carlos in the same thought put my teeth on edge. But after Bo gets everyone sick by making them believe that they're sick, it gets really out of hand. He is banned from school until the whole thing clears up, but he still manages to get in trouble. After seeing Carlos at the mall with Maddie, he gets really mad. He punches Carlos, which is an extreme violation. After visiting the judge, he is sentenced with five years working at a McDonald's plant with, where he will be making pizza. After eating and making nothing but pizza, they got sick of it pretty fast. Then his boss, Hammer, tells him that there will be tryouts for his football team, and the people who get in will be called the Gold Shirts, and will get many extra things. After a couple hours of brutal tryouts, which involved Bo climbing over a fence to get a rescue ball, and almost being eaten by a polar bear, Hammer says that Bo got in. They practice every day, and after a couple of weeks, they begin to think that something's up. It says on page 139, Still, I had to wonder if there was more to it than that. We gold shirts were being trained to beat the crap out of each other, sure. But I had the feeling we were also being trained to beat the crap out of somebody else. So after practicing more and more and getting hurt even more too, their suspicions proved to be correct.